Hey guys, Moshe the Electric Israel is here and thank you for joining. Uh, so the day has arrived uh, in Tesla, according to Elon Musk tweet from yesterday, Tesla has released uh, the uh, first um, leg, I would say, the first level of full self-drive to very, very, very selected uh, uh, Tesla uh, owners who are expert drivers, according to Elon Musk, and very careful drivers. And Elon Musk said that this is going to be the uh, launch is going to be extremely, extremely careful. What I predict, it, it's obviously it is a beta, it's a beta version of the full self-drive, and it will be what uh, probably uh, turn turns. That's what it's going to be. So as of now, you have a navigate an autopilot, you have a, a stop signs, you have uh, uh, traffic lights and all that. But now, on, on a navigation, if you put the, if you put the destination the navigation, the Tesla, the car will put a sing, signal and then it will turn right and left, traffic lights, stop signs, and whatever. But that with the intervention of a driver, meaning a driver has to be there and a driver has to take over and all that. That's gonna be done very, 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 very carefully. And I think it's a mega milestone. This is the famous uh, rewrite that Elon Musk talked about uh, last, actually last month at the, um, at the battery day. Uh, it's gonna be a big uh, rewrite. And again, very few people are gonna get it. And slowly, slowly, as Tesla collects data, and that's what Tesla does the best, they collect data. As data is collected, uh, more and more uh, features are going to be released and more and more and more people are going to get it. Now, here's my prediction. Knowing uh, what's been going on with Tesla Autopilot, using Tesla Autopilot, and using uh, Navigate and Autopilot in my car many, many times, uh, Here's what I predict is going to happen. I think full autonomous, meaning driverless car, are not coming anytime soon. But what I do think that ride hailing, uh, ride sharing uh, for Tesla car, for for Tesla owners and Tesla cars is coming much faster than than you think, and, and that's why it behooves Tesla to sell as many cars as possible. For, for them to create what is, I would call the robo-taxi, but with a driver inside, meaning an app, just like an Uber or Lyft, uh, that Tesla can uh, as say to their uh, owners, okay, you want to participate in that, uh, using uh, uh, autonomous driving, using the full self-drive with a driver inside, that will be a fantastic, fantastic opportunity. Uh, a, People can buy into this. They don't, maybe you don't have to buy a car. Uh, you can, uh, you know, lease some kind of a lease program that you can do. And, and if you want to use it for ride sharing, uh, and then have an option to buy it later or something like that. That is, believe me, this is this is a huge market. Not big, huge market of um, the future of Tesla. So that's why selling. Uh, as many cars they can is incredibly important. Now I have to mention, you know, Waymo uh, said that they're going to uh, have a full autonomous. They're going to let people go into their uh, Waymo cars uh, without a driver and go from point A to point B. Well, that's only in uh, in Arizona. It's in a very uh, limited space. Tesla doesn't do that. Tesla collects data from all the drivers and have billions of miles. Of, of data from all their drivers and they're gonna go all the way. So what Waymo is doing is very limited to a certain area from here to there and back and that's great. Uh, but what Tesla is doing is something completely different and I think this is a huge milestone and in the next weeks and months, uh, we'll see how this develops and I think it's one of the biggest news uh, for Tesla uh, starting to come out. Let me know your thoughts in below. I'll see you all tomorrow.